Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Halla, halla, halla. Uh, last time around, we had some pretty good tr plot progress. We find out that Sigurd's arm's being chopped off, which is fucked up. We upgraded our armor, which is great because I hadn't done that once in the game. And now I did it, and the armor looks like crazy cool now. Our weapons also have been upgraded significantly, so hopefully we'll be doing more damage. We'll be taking less damage, which will be nice. I have three skill points to use. All right, and we're working towards Brush With Death, which we can now get. Melee critical chance increase. What's this over here? Predator bow combo? Oh, yeah, I wanted to do that. All right, there we go. Abilities? I don't think I have any new abilities, right? No, it's just one of them was upgraded. Yeah, the axe throw has been upgraded. An enemy, an enemy gets stuck at staggered. That's cool. So, what are we doing right now? I think we've unlocked a new region that we need to travel to. Is this it here? Yup. A breviary, a breviary of broken hearts. Find out what the Erlderman of Essex wants of you. So we're heading to a new area. We're going to unlock some new viewpoints. Um, you know, and go from there. Now, outside of that... We've reached the settlement level 5. Level 6, I believe, is the maximum. Um... <clears throat> The Jotunheim mission, remember Jotunheim, which is the uh, second part of Asgard? We could do that, but the reason that I'm purposely not doing it... Um, the reason that I'm purposely not doing it is because it says it's level 190, which I'm not. If you take a look here, I'm on level 160. So I will, I probably will do it. We just want to wait till I'm higher level to tackle it, you know. Vinland as well. Look at this. Gorm... Gravelwoodson is re resurfaced stronger than before. Hytham might know how to track him down. Speak to Rondvi? Oh, really? Eivor. Uh. This isn't it. Let's go to Grander Britisher. That's not it, is it? I'm confused. I want to see the Alliance map. This is confusing because I already grabbed. I already did the Essex one. Yeah, Essex. I don't know. It says to talk to her about it, but this. I have changed not... my mind. Oh wait, what? No, I didn't. Oh wait, okay. Because this is a mission. I think this is supposed to be a side mission with her. That has nothing to do with anything. So that's why I haven't done it yet, right? But yeah, I think we're just go. gonna do the main plot at this point. All right, let's keep doing the main plot. So, uh, let's see here. Shout out to Marita Lucina who gifted us up to Covert Kale. Congrats, Covert Kale. Thank you, Marita Lucina, for the support. Ninstar Rune Shears says, everything you could attain, attain enlightenment and become the next Buddha? Yes, I could. It is possible. <clears throat> Anything's possible. All right. Um, looks to me like we can actually fast travel here and then head northwest. So, let's do that. Is this game actually good? Yes, Snow Carl. It is good. Get Ban says, hey, how's it hanging? It's hanging good. Slightly to the left, but, you know, hanging well. Maladoon. I'm in Maladoon. Maladooni. Do this viewpoint first so we can fast travel here again, of course. And my horse. Maladooni. Hello, Sir Spartan King. Give me the cheer earlier. <laughs> oh, fuck. Maybe I should actually wake up before I start streaming. I told you guys, I was like, I don't know why. I woke up this morning feeling very sluggish. I had a coffee, and I haven't had coffee in a long time. But I had a coffee this morning, and I'm still like, yawning. I'm like, oh, man. I must not have got sound sleep or something. I don't know. <clears throat> Weird, because I don't remember. I, don't, I didn't go to sleep extra late. I went to sleep around the usual time. So I don't know why I'm so tired today. I guess it just happens some days. Okay. What kind of shit animations are these? Did someone just make fun of my animations? On the channel? Why would you do that? Why are you making fun of my animations, man? That's not right. It's messed up. We're all here to have a good time and play some fun games. Why you gotta make fun of me? What's your problem, man? Stop that right now. Don't be negative. Come on. Don't be a jerk. 
How many hours do I normally get of sleep? I'd say between maybe six, six and a half, roughly. It depends on the day when I get to sleep, but usually around six, six and a half. Aha, look what we got. A staircase to in. It might be inside, though. It is inside. Okay. Hmm. I'm saying there's a staircase here? Or not, excuse me, not a staircase. Okay, I see. I have to fall down into here. I love having the explosive arrow. It makes it so much easier to do this kind of exploration stuff. I have no idea what I'm coming down here for. Boy, it's dark. I see a key. Look at all this. Oh, God. Skeleton. It's another way out. It is, but I don't see another way to go here, right? Oh, wait a minute. Oh, no, no, no. I thought that was a door for a second. Can I climb? Wait a minute. Is there a way to climb through here? I think there is. Aha, you couldn't really see it at first? What's this? Another skeleton? There's a lot of dead people down here. It's fucked up. People died down here. Oh, look what I found. It's in another Assassin's Bureau. Yeah. <clears throat> it's the second bureau I've now discovered. There's a big chest right there. Now, how would I get in there? There's got to be a way. Looks like there's a key underwater. Swim underwater here. Or maybe I can go up. <clears throat> An abandoned assassin's bureau. Shit. Ton of loot. So dark. Why the hell would the key be down there? Angel Besha says, is there an overarching story to Assassin's Creed anymore like they did with Desmond, or is it a bunch of Abstergo employees looking for memories? Um, there is, but it's super confusing because it's such a minor part of the game at this point that you frequently just forget what the hell's going on. Like, there is that woman from the last two games is still going into these past apparently they, they got some anonymous signal that said you need to go into the, the memories of Ivor to find the solution to save the world because remember the world is like falling apart and shit because of uh b because they're like something's going on with the magnetism or something some weird shit there's something going on with magnetism that's destroying the planet and so you need to find a way to like save it it's not like clear cut what's going on because I don't remember from the previous games, but something went like horribly wrong and is destroying everything. And you gotta find a way to solve it. Something like that. Westside Phil just did a 300 bit cheer. Thank you, Westside Phil, for a 300 bit cheer now. So much support today. I appreciate that. It looks like over there there may be something too, but let's let's go over here first. Must be from the other Wait, side. what? I unbarred the door. What? I just unbarred it. I, maybe it was a different door? Maybe I gotta go to this side? Oh, here we go. Alright. Read. Evacuation orders. The death of Imperator Honorius, all hope of stability and balance in Britannia is lost. 
The time has come to leave these shores. I wonder how long ago that was. I got a codex page, huh? Yeah. Hidden One's Hood. See if it's any good. The Hidden One's Hood. Well, the Hidden One's Hood is considered a superior cloak. Of course, I upgraded the Brigantine Cape to be much better, so I'm not going to wear it. If I want to do a full Raven set, it's a piece of Raven armor. Honestly, it doesn't even appear to be as good as the Magister's Cloak. I think this one's a little bit better. So... Okay. So I think I've successfully looted everything now. There is an item over here, but I'm not sure how to get to it. How could I get to that item right there? There's a door. There's a staircase. How do I get to it? Uh... Huh. I don't know. I don't think you can get to it from here. It doesn't appear like you can. Maybe it's from a different location? I can't see right now. Dark as shit. It looks like there's a hidden staircase, but I have no idea how I would uh, get to it. I don't think you swim to it. See? This is... No, you can't swim over here. What's that? Some kind of an artifact? Titanium? Yeah. Okay, cool. Alright, we've successfully looted a big area here. This door doesn't open? What? Oh. There we go. Oh, another stairwell. Oh, but it's blocked. Look at that. Blocked. What do we got here? Oh, do you... Aha! Do we leave now? I guess we leave this way. How the fuck do I get out of here? Oh, here we go. I was confused. I'm like, how the hell do we get out of here now? <clears throat> Why no chat interaction? Because I'm, I was focusing a little bit on the game, but I was talking with you guys. All right, good. Well, that was uh, that was good. We found a lot there, right? That was pretty good. Now, where's the viewpoint? It's this way. Here we go. Be the Colonel since I beat this game yesterday. It's 8 out of 10 for me. It's a good game. Much better than Assassin's Creed Odyssey or Origins in my opinion. You know, I do. I definitely like the game. 
can't judge until I beat it, and right now I'm almost about halfway through, supposedly, so. Uh, excuse me. Uh, woo. Excuse me, excuse me. Disgusting Belgians. By the way, no, I did not receive any refund yet. People are asking me about Cyberpunk, because yesterday my Cyberpunk locked on my PS5. I can't play it anymore. So people are like, well, did you get your refund? No. I've gotten no message from Sony at all anywhere saying that they're going to refund me, and I've received no money back. So I can't play Cyberpunk anymore, yet I don't. I didn't get any money back, so it's kind of weird. Like, why would you lock my game and not refund me? I don't know. It, it could be in process, but it's so weird to me that I got no message. Like, I saw online, everyone who got a refund got a message from Sony stating that you were going to get a refund. I got no message anywhere. So I don't know what's going on. Ice Cream King says that you know you already beat it. That's fine, but then they can't lock it. It's either I keep the game and we're done, or you lock the game and you give me my money back. You can't lock the game and prevent me from playing a game I fucking bought. That's actually illegal. <laughs> you can't do that. <clears throat> okay. So, a lot of stuff here. We already lo uh, looted the bureau, so that's done. A lot of loot here in town. Various vendors and the like. A few things are glowing. But we're going to try to advance the plot, so we're going to go here. An uncommon proposition. All right. <clears throat> the thing that just, get, that just weirds me out is, why did I not get a message? Like, everyone else seems to have gotten a message who was going to get a refund. Everyone got a message from Sony. Saying, FYI, we're refunding you. I didn't get any message. Zero. So, <laughs> that is just so weird that everyone else got one. I didn't get anything. Wait a minute. What is going on here? It appears to me I cannot get this from here. Oh, wait, never mind. Yes, I can. I go here, then here, then I start going down this way. Okay, never mind. I'm stupid. Evasion up. Melee up. And then next I'll go down here. Yeah, I'll do these. Okay. Oh, my God. Look at this. Are you kidding me? Ladies and gentlemen. Westside Phil just gifted another 50 subs. The channel has seen so many subs today, it's been ridiculous. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much to Westside Phil for the channel support today. Congratulations to the following people. Are you ready? Dballer429, Toddish, C, Meat Castle, Darkside Krill, Bleach Number 9, Roted Rocky, Celtic G, Hamid 7th, Rafidler38, Torakill, Mick Bennett. Race Car Driver 79, Max Boy, Alexander Fire 24, Rookie 2B, Wagrain, Robert Trehart, Stilma 7IC, Monsterami, Pixlar, Pixlar Sun, Feckit, Naruto X Sasuke X Kakashi, <laughs> Mr. Kaye, Cordy the Programmer, Sean Torius, Espionage Bob, Zeta Zero, Delon Mower 97, One Parrot, Brian Gaming 28, Crim Sane Pain Train, Ciara Bahiana, Corgal, Danny Girl 3116, Shiny Materia, Flepker, Wild Man 88, Toxic Toilet Frog, Evilibrium, Rock Mountain 19, JP Was Taken, Mr. Palm Trees 007, King Gokin, Scrupulous, Duke Argos, Sheik Mark, The Rhythm One, Skater Slim, and Fald Tarn. Congratulations to everyone who got a gifted sub today. Let's now see where we are with subs. 993 subscriptions. Holy crap. That is a lot of subs in one day. Thank you very, very, very much to Westside Phil for all the support this morning. Jethro's main cheered and said, I want to count how many things you claim to be illegal. I love when you say that. What you just said is illegal, Jethro's man. You better watch what you say or I might alert the authorities. All right. Hooey. Let's continue. Okay, apparently he's over there near the statue. Alright. Oh my god. Dude, I can't. I 
can't wake up. What's going on today? I seriously can't wake up today. My body's it seems tired. Elderman Beerstan has made this ruin his longhouse. This house here? Or this building here? Why is my cup empty? Perhaps because you have drunk the barrel dry? Damn, Beerstan. His household is as poorly run as his land. Whoa. Astrid is a good wife. Far better than he deserves. You would say that, Adrian. Your wife acts like a sow in a skirt. My sweater right is a worthy woman, you coxcomb. But she's an excellent cook. With a fine nose for truffles. If Birsten does not return soon, wine will not be the only thing spilled upon his floors. Now, gentlemen, everyone is fractious with this waiting. Let us be civil at least. What is going on here? Lord. Ah, a heroic looking Dane in our midst. I'm looking for Birsten, the elderman of the Shire. Our lord is not at home, but his wife is receiving visitors upstairs in her usual fashion. If you speak with her, pass on that we've run out of ale. Okay. I don't know what's going on here. Everyone's insulting each other. <laughs> Everyone's being a dick to each other. Like, what the fuck? Whoa, is it glitching up the stairs? One cry from me. What the hell? Sheathe your blade, lady. I'm Eivor of the Raven Clan. Here at your husband's request. Another Dane. I am Estrid, wife of the Lord of Essex. As you may have heard, my lord is not at home. It's not French, right? You don't speak as one from here. Where's your home? These rain sodden bogs and fog washed hills are not my home. <laughs> Christ, I come from Francia. Yeah, France. My grandfather walked on Frankish sod. He spoke of an appetite for conquest that rivaled our own. Sadly, oh, my conquests car outside. are reduced to wow. pettish stains and graceless men. All Frankish fire extinguished. I'm wary of rounding up Saxons. Is your husband stolen, drunk, or wayward? He'll be stalking the woodlands today, hunting game and ignoring the vital affairs of Essex. <laughs> One such affair is why we called for you. If I can find him, I'll remind him of his duties. Ah, such would be a miracle. His favorite haunt is southwest of here. The lavender fields there attract the prey, God help him. With luck, he hasn't been eaten, but I'll <laughs> turn either way. I'm gonna go find him, he's on the hunt. Okay. The first French person in the game. A breviary of broken hearts. Okay. Um, an anonymous gifter just gifted a subs to the channel. Even the saints were tired of waiting for Beer Stand to hang up his bow. Dear Estrid, we must discuss the affairs of this land, with or without him. It sounds to me like what they're saying is he's a very bad ruler. Like he's ignoring all the problems, right? Like, he's not paying any attention to them, and everyone's pissed off that he's not doing anything as a ruler, and so he's just, like, fucking hunting and drinking and shit. Huh. Anyway, an anonymous gifter gifted eight subs to the channel. One to Stomp a Twitch, Urun Che, Capricorn 180191, Shinigami 966, Cavers 95, John Diaper, Best Compilation Official, and Big White. Congratulations to all of you. The channel is now sitting at 1,002 subscribers. We gained a lot of subs today. I'm not going to lie. That was a lot of subs, and you guys are being very supportive today, and I really appreciate that. Thank you very much for that. Holy crap. Alrighty then. So yes, by the way, this does mean, because we hit the subscriber goal, we will be doing a viewer's choice event. Uh, likely what I'll... <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> likely what we'll do is once... The retrospective event happens um we will do the viewers choice nominations uh as soon as the retrospective nominations are closed because right now the retrospective is the next special event taking place likely at the end of this month if not why is he vibrating when he goes down look at his body when he goes up and down these stairs hold on look at his cape what the f and he goes down and he says Oh, okay. It's nice and flat. 
<laughs> what is going on? You're freaking bugs. Anyway. Yes, so... What's going to happen is, we're going to do the retrospective event either at the end of this month or early next month. It depends on timing of game releases and the like. Um, hey, no. Fuck you. Again. They want to fight me. No, they want to fight. Um, so, people need to nominate for that first before we start working on another event. Alright, so please keep nominating your favorite moments <clears throat> from my 12 plus years as a content creator. By typing exclamation point retrospective into the chat. Or every 20 minutes or so, another, um, a, a link will pop up for you to do that. And I appreciate it if you would, because that will help tremendously. The more things we have nominated, the better the event will be, all right? Once those nominations close off and we schedule the retrospective event, then we will set up the ability for you guys to nominate and vote on games for this upcoming Viewer's Choice event, okay? <clears throat> this place would have been impressive once, a long time ago. Battle of 9000 says the way he's walking up and down the stairs is why he impresses all the ladies. Oh, that... <laughs> it's very impressive, let me tell you guys. Yes. <laughs> it woos all the Saxons. Dragon Man says they stole bugs from Cyberpunk. Now, this came out before Cyberpunk. This game has a lot of bugs. I think a lot of people don't realize it because people stopped talking about this game when Cyberpunk came out. But... It's full of bugs. Like, there's a ridiculous amount of bugs in this game. What are we looking at here? A cave? I found a cave. And face God's justice, devil. What? Well, we've stumbled upon a random mission. I guess we'll see what it is. Mjorn Cavern? Why are you praying here? <clears throat> we pray for strength to face the one within that cave. A devil in man's form who commands the beasts themselves. Hmm? Many times we have seen him feeding the wild beasts and speaking with them. <laughs> Even the wolves do not savage him. Are you sure? You Christians are quick to name devil that which you do not understand. The birds in this wood are restless and swift to attack. Only yesterday, a fox snatched a babe from its crib. Have no doubt. He who walks backwards is what? among us. <laughs> Either he will come out of there, or we will go in. What is happening? What is happening? Let's find out. Is this the lair of the man or the beast? Hello. Oh, nice bear. Wait a minute. Look at that armor. That's pretty unique. Who is this guy? You keep company with the bear. Are you as the monk says? The animals be my friends. I hear them, and they hear me. They hurt this one. No, they want to hurt me. But you have set your beasts some people before. Them's that hurt my friends get hurt. But I never hurt no baby. You don't deserve to die. You've only been defending those you love. Stay here and tend to your friend. I will see to the monks outside. Don't kill them. Don't want that. Scare them off. It's the animals they fear, remember? Hmm. What's with this armor set? It's like completely unique, right? I haven't seen an armor that looks like that in the game. I wonder if you like get this or something as a reward. We want to meet. Hello. What a nice bear. Nice behaved bear. There's nothing wrong with that bear. He's nice. Yeah, look. Basically, animals and stuff that they would eat for food. And, you know, they're not wasting any part of the animal. Survival skills. Kind of reminds me of the Native Americans. <clears throat> All right. Uh, Fat Steven Seagal has just subscribed to the channel. Congratulations to Fat Steven Seagal. Ninstar Rune, not on being fat or being Steven Seagal, but for subscribing. Ninstar Rune just cheers. Says, shout out to that dude who hung out with bears and got eaten by them. Ouch. <clears throat> Wait, Jack Lee says, look at the cape. Okay, hold on. Maybe there's something unique here. I'm missing. No, nothing special. I think he's talking about my cape. <laughs> I think he likes my cape. Anyway. Have you seen him? Or 
has the devil's tongue. Feel stronger already. Oh my god, I can assassinate him. Oh shit, if you assassinate, then they will away. Oh! Damn. Well, that got rid of them. Now I gotta hide the body. Damn, I wanted to splatter down there, it didn't. Oh! <laughs> Alright, dispose of the body, very nice. <clears throat> Did I talk to the guy again now? I don't know what to do. know if you are what they say you are but I've seen to your tormentors <laughs> I laid about them with my blade blood brings blood more will come things worse now you win and I better go somewhere else I did what I could farewell then and good fortune well devil's hole I don't even know if that's what you're supposed to do but oh well yeah, he said not to kill him, but there was no option to not kill him. There was no option to just talk to the guy. It was just kill. So, I don't know what else I was supposed to do. <laughs> Maybe that was the bad ending. Oh, well. Oh, well. Fuck it. Um, so the mission's over here. But I think I want to unlock another fast travel point over here first. So that way I have a way to get out here to the to the woods if I need to. And then we'll do the, the story mission. Oh, really? Holy Warrior Tonin says you can actually get Thor's armor set and weapon in this. That's cool. Shu Cow says the next story part will be the the Sussex, and after that there really aren't many more story. There's no like major story until the end of the game. The thing is though, there are on the, if you looked at the map there are more areas. So I'm not, I'm not sure what you mean. Are you saying that those aren't story? It doesn't make sense though because they're on the map to, to conquer just like all the other ones. So I'm not sure what you mean by that. <clears throat> Oh, Cookie Monster says he said they were scared of animals. That was the clue. What was I supposed to do with an animal? What the fuck? <clears throat> Another random world event here. What? Well, we'll see what's going on with that in a second. Let's do the viewpoint first. <clears throat> Hello, Maniac Cop. How are you? Musical prodigies, even. Look at his hair. But that madman, <laughs> the self-proclaimed Bishop of the Ruins, is our biggest critic. He calls our playing the Devil's Bagpipes. <clears throat> it's a strange instrument made of bladder and bone. It does wheeze like an old woman. He drives away our audience with his doom knelling. All we want is to bring a little joy to this jilted generation. A worthy aim. Maybe he needs convincing of your talents. <laughs> you would volunteer? Really? Ah, oh, you are a lover of fine music. This is surely an omen. Ah, this 
cacophony. It is as if a okay. Why not let the boy play music? He brings pleasure to the people. Music is the devil's wind breaking. Foul and rancid. I, as the bishop of the ruins, will not stand for it. Nice hairdo, bishop by the way. Of the ruins. Is this title Alfred given? It is God given. He spoke to me as I stood one night pissing against the stone. <laughs> I yes. am his instrument to stamp out the devil's <clears throat> tune. Then you and I must disagree. Oh shit, what the fuck? Smack my bishop! Oh my god, did you say smack my bishop? Get it? Smack my bishop! <laughs> Smack my bishop! Okay then. What a pun on words. You have done us a great service. I will compose this day into song. Farewell. May you continue to make merry harmonies. Smack my bishop! Smack my bishop! Oh my god! It is a fucking reference to it. The prodigy. Prodigy smack my bitch up. Smack my bitch up. <laughs> I can't believe they put that in the game. Are you kidding me? <laughs> the name of the band is Prodigy. I can't believe they put that in the fucking game. A fucking Prodigy reference. Who would have thought in 2021, like a good 21 years after the song being popular, there would have been a reference to that song in Assassin's Creed Valhalla. I would not have assumed that. Yeah, Angela Betcher says that's the hair of the Prodigy guy. You're right. That was the hairdo the Prodigy guy had. <clears throat> what on earth? I see. So Shukau is saying there will be other regions where you need to get allies, but there's only like one other major story mission left that will relate to like Sigurd and stuff. I see. In Star Wars, is old school East Coast or old school West Coast rap? Uh, for me... <clears throat> the, the height of rap for me was like Dr. Dre, Snoop Dogg, and Eminem. So, there you go. I know there was other, like, my, like other groups. Like, for example, a lot of people were into Biggie. A lot of people were into Tupac. I wasn't really into it at that point. It was really, like, late 90s, early 2000s when I was into rap, so. Hunting is a fine sport, but I hope the Elderman has not become the prey. No good comes from a camp this bloody... What happened? Oh god, oh god. Uh, are they all dead? They might all be dead. Examine. Caught off guard as they supped. That sucks. They were attacked by a beast. Something strong enough to kill the horse. It was a tiger. A wild tiger. Some large prey left these tracks in the grass. Uh... What else? I don't see anything else. Oh, there was something I missed in the camp. <clears throat> of the hunting party. This one was savaged by a large animal. The hunters were prey to a large beast or two. I can only hope that Biestam still lives. Okay. Loot. So, how do I find him? What do you see? Over here. Okay. Jad F just cheers as a shout out to Keith nine lead vocals who passed away two years ago oh oh the guy the guy from prodigy died I didn't know that yeah I did not know that stretch your wings soon oh shit oh a million bears Got one. Your weapon strikes true. Ha! We'll fight to the death. 
Should I just tossing the bear around? Jesus, that's fucked up. Just tossing the bear, man. Ugh. <clears throat> well, I saved his ass. You have my gratitude to stumble upon me in my moment of greatest peril. Perhaps you were God sent. I'm Estrid sent. Your wife <laughs> and the veins of Essex both want your balls on a blacksmith's anvil. When do they not? You could return and report that the savage claw took me. <laughs> Poor Beerstan, his exit pursued by a bear. And make the beast Lord of Essex in your stead. <laughs> no doubt my Estrid would prefer his <clears throat> velvet paws to my callous hands. So, who are you? A cell sword? I come at your call. I'm Norse, no coin groveler. Intriguing. We Saxons hear only that Danes and Norse are ferocious barbarians, all teeth and claws, with no <laughs> subtlety or wit. But ho, are you the Norse I sent word to? I am Eivor of the Raven Clan. You hinted at an alliance for the loan of my unique talents. It's blood, yes. Let us return to Colchester at once, and we'll speak more of the delicate matter on my mind. Hmm. I'm glad you answered my summons. Ugh. I did not expect such a skilled fighter. It's good I came when I did. We lost many men on this hunt. Hey, you saved his ass. He lost everyone. They will have the proper rights and their families will be cared for. Your people sacrificed much for your sport. They did. There is no balm for my tortured heart. Why did you ask me here? Do you believe in true love, Eivor? What? I have loved. Oh boy. But have you truly? Has a longing burned in your breast, a sweet lingering pain, paralyzing you with its sting? There's pain enough in battle, but not seek it out in love. I long for it, the thrill of a fight softly won. My wife Estrid lacks fire. She is a fish out of water, cold and dead. <laughs> wow, what a nice thing to say. When I met her, keeping your pains in check. Oh, they love her, it is true. Some with too much devotion. And I have not been a good and attentive husband. I have always been a plucked goose in matters of love. And a piss poor ruler to boot. As strong must be the hand that steers the ship, Piston. My hand would rather tug the cat gut of a well crafted bow. My eyes narrowing at the sight of. <laughs> I hit the guy. Aye. The crown sits heavy on the head. Then let us run wild and free in the woods as the wolves do. Live on our wits, prowl and stalk and feast. You have a romantic way about you, Bistan. <laughs> Do not fret. My God. Jesus, the woman. <laughs> you when we are together. You mismark me if you think I'm capable of worry. Have you built your city in the ruins of another? No, these builders are lost to the annals of time. Far advanced of the Saxon hovels of Wattle and Daub. I have ambition to build a great palace myself with mosaics and balmy courtyards. What stops you? That which stops all but the most creative minds. Coin, imagination, talent. And your people? Is Essex happy? That is a question I never really ponder. I suppose they are. I hope they are. Jesus, I another one! <laughs> he runs down everyone with his fucking horse! Squawking over nothing but the farmer's dinner. He interferes. No, he disapproves. <laughs> is that not infinitely worse? But look, we are nearing my hall. I must face the wolves at my door before we discuss your favor to Essex, Abel. It may be I can speed your business along. Huh? What do I do? He's stuck. I don't know what to do. He was glitched. He was stuck on the horse. I had to move the horse, then he started walking. Okay. Here we go. Oh, let's see here. Jad F. Cheer, he said, hold on. He said, I had the fortune to go to a project game four years ago, and it was as wild as you can get. Damn. Marita Lucina gifted a sub to Bullhorn Express. Congrats to Bullhorn Express, and thank you, Marita Lucina, for the gifted sub. I appreciate that. Fend All right. The spears of their displeasure. <clears throat> Let them speak their woes. I'll uh. advise you if I can. 
Who is this owl, Beerston, that twitters in your ear? An advisor, nothing more. Here to help Essex navigate her brewing storms. Now, my dear brethren, Adrid, perhaps you will start us off. What troubles you? You're a Listen. disgrace, Beerstan. Couldn't get a sow pissed in an alehouse. Alfred's men are crawling all over Essex. King hmm. Alfred, yes. Though it is within his right, the constant presence of his men is certainly an issue. Send them back to Alfred. They will soon grow bored of meddling. Full grown in strength, the mistletoe stood. What? The fuck does that mean? When the months are coldest, the mistletoe is full grown, cloaked in her winter strength. Meaning that we should weather this? Stay strong? Yes, that's it. Not bend in the wind like stalks of wheat. <laughs> and you, Wyatt, what do you say? Your preparations for the Lammas Festival. How can you think of spending so much coin when your people are starving? Why as long as the answer to any problem, you should contribute. Nor fasting come to the feast. Often should one make an early meal, nor fasting come to the feast. The feast, yes. The festival. This is not for full bellies, but to bless the loaf. Does that not bring us all good fortune? And Aldrich, do you yap like a she-hound as Adrid does? <laughs> you know my thoughts, Beerston. The fear. How can we give men to Alfred for his wars when our harvest <coughs> suffers day by day? Hmm. Here we have a wear of sleep in a witch's bosom. You what? Of sleep in a witch's bosom, nor let her limbs ensnare you, for she will not bring an early harvest. What? I, uh, bosom's that? Uh, no. I'm afraid I don't know what that means, Abel. <laughs> <laughs> have I not answered all your questions? I thank you for your candor, Bearstan. You have put my mind somewhat at ease. Aye, indeed. What? How did you answer the guy's continue, question? Now, <laughs> if you'll pardon me, I have much to discuss with my wife. What the hell? That was ridiculous. <laughs> this is a stupidly silly segment. I sense you had some fun there, Abel. What the fuck? He's walking and on your a fool. Playful wickedness backfooted my squabbling thames. I don't know what you speak of, Lord. All this talk of hunting makes me long for the woods. Oh, your oh, wife oh, awaits, oh, Beston. Oh, 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 Aren't you worried some other man will drench your sheets with his sweat? Ha! <laughs> she does as she must. As do I. But you will discover this soon enough. Mr. Roach, you said this is great. Now this dude's gonna think all Norsemen speak in riddles. <laughs> Return my <coughs> errant gander to his coop. My pettish love, such a stormy countenance clouds the sun of my return. Your thanes drank the ale the abbot gifted us, all of it. Now that is a tragedy my heart will not easily overcome. If he looked at me with the same affection he shows for hunting deer, our marriage might have survived. Your love has gone sour. What do you need of me, Burston? Essex seems at odds. Essex seems at odds with itself. Have you called me here to fix the many problems I've already seen today? <laughs> no, no. I would not <clears throat> inflict the infighting of my thanes upon you, Eivor. Our matters are more delicate. And of a more personal bent, requiring a finesse and discretion that these Saxons often lack. So, what do you need of me? Our affairs are more of heart than of state, Eivor. What little passion there was between us faded into bickering long ago. We would have our freedom, Eivor. I from my wife, and my wife from Essex. I'm too sharp a weapon for so soft a task. Why not part and be done with it? Oh, were I a Dane, and divorce as simple as a slit throat. But it's not so easy as that. Hmm. All right, what does that mean? Your god prevents it, your king prevents it, I will do what you ask of me. Like, how, yeah, what's preventing them from splitting? Then what is stopping you? Your king, Alfred? Ours was not a union of love, but necessity. Decreed by Alfred's father to strengthen ties with Frank. Ah, political marriage. Not easily broken. I get Explain it. Explain yourselves, clear and plain, and I will do it. The poetry here is mind mud. We had a plan, a simple plan. A woman lost and a woman found. Some time ago, we paid a Dane to kidnap me and ferry me safely to Francia. As you can see, he did not deliver. He was certainly thorough in other regards. Some Norse can be quick to take coin and slow to earn it. If I give my word, it is not broken. 
Could we try the kidnap again? Much of the planning is done. It would only take a more trustworthy overseer. It should be a bold venture if we do. Loud and brash and seen by all. During our Lamas festival, merry peasants and guards with wandering eyes. Your return to Frankia would need a swift ship, with a captain ready to leave England. We could ask him. I would have thought his steed and seamen spent. Come find me in the market table. Our unwelcome guests require food and ale to soften their anger. My wife is a gracious and attentive host, Abel. The only thing that keeps my braying thanes at bay. And the woman found? A darling Maybud, Alvida, my childhood sweetheart. I left her <coughs> twenty years ago in Malden to marry <coughs> my physical Excuse pair. Me. Twenty years? Can an ember so cold be reignited? We can hope. You must fan the flame. Find her, bring her to my lakeside cottage, and light a bonfire there. I will know to come. I believe she lived in the last house in Molden. A small, sweet place where fond memories were made. I will do as you both ask, and ask Freya for success in this love game. Oh my god. Good luck in your endeavors, Eivor. I pray you find my Alvida with a fair face and a yearning heart. Now, should I look for Alvida first, or meet with Estrid at the marketplace? Well, we gotta choose what you wanna do, right? We gotta do a stage of fake kidnapping or find his freaking <laughs> his true love. I don't know why the hell we're doing that. He better pay us a big amount of money for that. Or some kind of good reward. Um So Okay, here's the two. Help Escher to arrange her escape. Find Alfida and bring her to Burston. I have fast travel for that, which is good. I can just fast travel over there. And we'll do the escape part first. <clears throat> Try to do that first, right? I'll be gaming some what's for dinner tonight. We're going to have a uh, baked chicken. Oh, my God. Oh, I'm trying to wake up. I still feel tired, man. Yeah, we're having a big chicken tonight, um, which is good. My, you know, my wife making, um, uh, my wife making it is her custom breading with seasoning and stuff in it. It's really good. So, baked chicken for dinner. Whew. All right. Um, let's get out of here. Just hanging out. Being stupid. Alright, well, thank you guys very much for all the support today. I'm actually curious now. Uh, we're now 1,005 subscribers. Holy crap. I appreciate that, guys. So, thank you to Lysmer Soul, who's currently the top cheerer. Obviously, Westside Phil gifted a ton of subs to the channel today, but so did an anonymous sub gifter. Thank you to, to them, and of course, to anyone else who, who subbed or gifted a sub. Thank you to the one tipper of the day so far, once bitten, with $11 tip. I appreciate that. Now, remember, guys, I really appreciate your help, but I do need help with tips today. Tomorrow, I'm going out, and I, where I need to spend a lot of money on stuff, important stuff for the week. So your tips help with that. If you could tip me today, I would greatly appreciate it. And, of course, we have tips goals. We hit certain levels of tips. So uh, thank you for that. Let's see if we can hit those. I mean, I swear a vest today. I did not wear a vest yesterday at all. Okay. Hey. I keep forgetting this is a hostile area for some reason. I don't understand why it is. It's just a fucking... It's a pool. Why are they guarding the pool? Pretty dumb. Ah! Arrows in my ass. I was gonna say, get rid of this stupid there aggro. Are, Here we Over. go. I came first to help you. <laughs> your need seemed more pressing. And now my marriage awaits your execution as sold. Will it not be strange to leave this place? You've lived here half your life. Yes, but what is to keep me here? A loveless union and the dirt mounds of two babes who never took a breath. <clears throat> you miss Francia. You speak with sadness. Let us discuss the plan. And what of our plan? The great Lama's kidnap. Is this a Christian feast? Yes, it's a wonderful evening. A blessing of the harvest. Full of fruits and fires. Drinking and dancing. Revelers with muddy minds and glazed eyes. 
That's good for us. And what of the ship that will sail you home? I know just the one, and her captain is full of fire. Come, I will take you to him. Okay. I was there. I saw it. This one's captain. screaming. Who is he? Not much more than a boy in his 17th year. Full of youthful bravado. A Saxon? A Dane. Though Adred calls you raiders, he says that you are here to steal England. Some may be. But I've come to settle a stretch of land. I'm not so keen to return to the winters of my birth in Norway. Mm -hmm. Norway? Ah! Oh, it must be beautiful. Rugged and fearsome. And cold as anything, the frozen north. Uh oh so cold. You guys are saying Twitch is screwed up again? Again? This is like the third time in a week. Seriously? Yeah, people are saying Twitch is screwed up again. They're trying to talk. And some stuff isn't going through. Snowcrawl can't see his friends list. It's like... <laughs> Boy, this thing can't consistently keep working this week. I wonder what the hell's going on with Twitch this week. We had a lot of problems. Well, I'm not gonna... Everything's working on my end. I don't want to hit refresh. It might screw everything up for me. Oh, really? Expand Dogs' says penny points were cleared out. It shows zero points. Yes, I can see you, Habib Gaming. Penny points will not load at all, apparently. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Hopefully it does fix it, guys. You know, obviously I have no control over that stuff. And unfortunately, Twitch had a ton of problems this week, right? This is at least the third time in one week that it's have issues, so. Alright. 